This was a very turbulent time during the development of our English Bible. The church in England, the government in England, uh, were very hesitant to allow this Bible to be translated into the English language. William Tyndall is put to the de uh, death in 1536. Uh, by this time frame, about 1560, many people have left England, many of the reformers, and they've gathered in Geneva, Switzerland. And the translation and the work of printing the Geneva Bible was very important. This Bible is the first Bible that really has numbered verses. It was intended as a study Bible. And it's almost like, what? You mean you want a Bible in your home? Yes, these people wanted a Bible in their home. So 1560 was the first printing of the Geneva Bible. Here we have a 1595 and a 1599 Geneva. And these are the smaller size Bibles that uh, can be used in a home. But this is a very important work. This Bible became a favorite. It's the Bible that uh, swept Western Europe. It was a Bible that was brought uh, to America by the pilgrims. These people brought the Bible to Jamestown. They brought it to Massachusetts. So it was a very popular Bible. Geneva Bible uh, should be recognized as a very important milestone in the development of our English Bible.